Hello, once again, my name is Javier Burgos, and this is a tutorial on how to use the Viewpoint Presentation Plus, which comes with the Viewpoint Books, Viewpoint 1, and Viewpoint 2. So I'm going to show you how to install it, and then briefly what you have inside. First of all, you have to look for Presentation Plus that comes with this in the CD. When you click on that, you get to this icon to install the software. And when you finish installing the software, you get this icon. Alright, it says Viewpoint Presentation Plus Level 1. So when you click over here, there you go. Let's make it bigger, wider, and then we'll take into this scrim, right? But we have all the components and uh, the digi the digital components of the book. So we have the contents over here. This is the contents for the student book, as you can see over here. So we have all the units and also the speaking naturally, grammar extra, irregular verbs the checkpoints, everything. Even the author's acknowledgments we have here, the scope and the sequence, everything. Right, so let's click on the unit three, and then we have the lessons. Lesson A, B, C, and D, and then the writing part, the vocabulary notebook. This is the number of the page, so we click over here, we're taking exactly to the page, right? And now, if we want to make this one bigger, we click here and we make it bigger, right? And then we drag it down and then we can see it, right? So you see this small icon over here means it's the audio. Page click three. there, you had the audio. Right. You can also view the script or the audio over here by clicking there. What special things has each person done? We interviewed people and asked, what are some of the highlights of your life so far? Right, so you can listen to the audio there and you can see everything there. Let's go back here. We clicked on unit 3. Now let's click on unit 4 and show you something else. So we go for example to uh, the ace that interview and then we are taking exactly to that page ace that interview right and there you go so if you want to view let me see right now right here we have this is the student book right here we had a workbook and all these contents obviously belong to the workbook see so we click on unit 7 well, let's click on unit 3 so we unit 4 is that interview we're going to get the word book same topic remember this one to enlarge the image right so we can reinforce the topic with this right because it's in the same topic so remember, you go here to this content, and then the first one you get is the student book, second one is the workbook. Then you get the video worksheets. All the these are the videos uh, worksheets to reinforce the topic as well. So we click on Unit 4, for example, Lesson A and Lesson C. Probably in lesson C, we're going to see something very similar to the topic we're looking at. Right. So, with this, we'll make it bigger. You can print this out as well. If you want to print, you can print it. No problem. Let's go to unit 1, lesson B. And then we have the worksheet. Everything is there. Right. This key shows you the answers for the worksheet see all the answers for example 
right it shows you the answers everything you click over here you're taken to the video as well you can also show the script here you can make it wider with this one or you can make it smaller right you can hide the script if you have a look at this the video is gone you hide the video you show the video once again and this is just to pause and to, to play the same video can be played from here from the part that says video you go here and you find all the videos over here so you click here you're taken to the same video we're watching right now right let's have a look at the video number two Right. Remember the worksheets for these are over here. You have this one. This is this one. Let's have a look at this. Yeah, there we go. So this is a worksheet for that. As you can see, let me show you over here. I just same guys, right? Same guys on the video. Same guys on the worksheets. Remember, you can show the script as well anytime you want right so what else do we have over here we have um, the videos to just show you this bookmark if you want to do something right I don't actually um, recommend it but just go unit by unit this is a dictionary that can help maybe um, just type and look it up and you take into you know a dictionary where you can have all these collocations and the words See for uh, um, the dictionary. With this arrow, you can change the menu and put it on the left or put it on the right. It depends. You can leave it on the left, for example, on the right. I'm gonna leave it on the right over here, and I can, you know, still be working with that. So it's not a problem with that, right? Or with this arrows, you can move forward the pages. Let's go back to the student book. And let's go back here and I'm gonna show you how do you move with that we had this one so we're on the page 26 let's go to page 27 this is page 27 you can see over here and you can see over here page 28 there you go page 28 right page 28 and then you keep moving forward click forward and then that's it and then you can also watch both pages if you want you can see this one is one it shows one page when I have one two it shows two pages so you can move forward and then it shows you two pages two pages right if you want now with this one this one just utilities that you can use maybe um, to highlight something you can you know, take notes or just highlight something here if you like or with this one is thicker or this one is to erase see erase everything right right so you can play with this anytime you want if you want to say you can save but I don't re actually recommend save Workbook, worksheets, remember, and you had the videos, workshops, a workbook, student book, workbook, and worksheets. The same way you are right here, see, same way you have on the button as well, right? So that's pretty much of that. This is the tutorial on how to use the Viewpoint Presentation Plus. I hope you like it, and I hope this is useful for you. Thank you very much, and I'll see you next time.